Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Hit Parade Autographed Hockey Mini Helmets. Series 4, 5 box break, random team break number 1. 31 spots, everyone gets a random team in the NHL and then we'll we'll see what we we'll see what we get. Some pretty solid soccer uh, soccer players, hockey players. Big thanks to this group right here for getting in on the action. And there are the names right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. One and a five, six times for each list. One, two, three, four, five. And once more. And again, sixth and final time. We got Larry down to Chris. One and a five, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. We've got the Blackhawks down to the Bruins. All right, Larry with the Chicago Blackhawks. Chris with the Pittsburgh Penguins and the Tampa Bay Lightning. Jonathan with the Hurricanes, Chris with the Kings and the Blue Jackets, Larry with the Senators and the Sharks, Charles with the Rangers, Steve Wright with the Oilers, Chris with the Jets and Predators, Mike with the Canucks, Jonathan with the Knights, Steve with the Stars, Karen with the Wild, Chris with the Canadians and the Avs, Charles with the Maple Leafs, Matthew with the Caps, Greg with the Blues, uh, Chris with the Devils, Mike with the Coyotes, Chris with the Flyers and the Panthers, Edwin with the Flames, Chris with the Islanders and the Sabres, Mitchell with the Red Wing, Chris Parent, with the Ducks, Chris Maxwell with the Bruins. All right, let's sort alphabetically by column B. We're going to pause the video, and we're going to allow for a little bit of trading time. And when we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back, folks. A little bit of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done here in this break. On Tuesday the 22nd, thanks, everyone, for getting in on the action. I appreciate it. All right, so we've got one, two, three, four, and five right here. So these are all hand numbered, 81 out of 100. All right, mini helmets right here. Oh, let's see what we have. And I, you know what? I don't know what's on this check. There's no checklist traditionally for products like this. So if there's a non-pro uniform rule, so we'll go by our no checklist rules here. If there's a non-pro, let's say it's their, it's a Team USA mini helmet or uh, their national team or something like that, or their college maybe, um, it'll go to, if they're active, it'll go to the team they're currently on, the NHL team they're currently on, or the NHL team uh, that they played for the longest. I guess if they're still active, but not in the NHL, they'll still go to the team they played for the longest. I think that makes the most sense. All right. Let's see who we have here. Okay, not in a plastic bag, it's just in this pouch. Guess the auto. So it's going to be boom. So we know it's the abs already, but guess that auto. <laughs> so congrats to uh, Chris Maxwell with the Colorado Avalanche. Or you can just start in it. Oh. Nice, B-Man. Yeah, it's Nathan McKinnon. <laughs> so you can see the names right in here. Nathan McKinnon. Good one. All right, so there, there's the autograph, Chris Maxwell. There's the NHL logo, the Fanatic sticker on the back. These are, these are pretty, 
pretty cute. <laughs> Are these cute? Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> Vanessa thinks they're so cute. Yeah, we don't we don't see a lot of like we don't see a lot of like uh we don't see a lot of these like mini hockey helmets. Yeah, <laughs> Vanessa thinks we could put it on a teddy bear maybe. All right, there you go. And the verification right there. No, I don't know if we're going to do who am I for hockey players. I don't know how many I guess Nate McKinnon, I think people would have I guess would have gotten it. Do people really want hockey who am I? I actually am familiar with Nate. I know who Nate McKinnon is. Should have done a Who Am I for him. Maybe Chris Maxwell. Congrats. David Rodriguez is going to have a baby in September. And you could put him in that little helmet? That'd be kind of cute. All right. All right, next one. I guess we can do a, a very quick round of who am I. It's what the people want. Even hockey? I was going to avoid hockey. All right. I'm a 22-year-old left wing and a lefty, played for one team my entire career, was picked seventh overall in 2016. Do you need stats? Does the draft class help? Um, I had 14 goals, 21 assists last season. Goes to where's my list here? That goes to that that person. Okay. Not Caprol, not Patrick Kane. I don't think Patrick Kane's 22 years old. From Chesterfield, Missouri. And uh, in September 2019, I was re-signed by my current team to an eight-year, $57.2 million contract extension. No, oh, let's start taking this out here. No other guesses? See, I think, I think we get kind of crickets with the hockey. <laughs> Come on, hockey fans. All right, I'll give you a hint. It's the Coyotes, Arizona Coyotes. So congrats to Mike Tower. Left winger, uh, you're going to know from this autograph. Oh, maybe not. Yep, B-Man's got it, Clayton Keller. It's got the Coyotes logos here, the Fanatic stickers on the back. I like the little shield. He plays center. I, I'm going by Wikipedia. I don't know. I don't know no hockey. According to Wikipedia, he's a left winger and shoots left. Someone needs to update his Wikipedia page. All right. So that's Mike Tower with the. Oh, and I'll show you that it says, it says Clayton Keller right there. I'll go to Mike. If I know this guy, you'll know this guy. All right, who am I? I'm a 24-year-old center, according to Wikipedia, and a righty. Played for one team my entire career. 6'2", 213 pounds. What were my stats last year? 
21 games, only 21 games played? 21 games played, two goals, 16 assists, and I must have gotten injured. Oh, yeah. In April, I was announced, it was announced that I would miss the remainder of the season in order to recover from surgery to repair a spinal disc herniation. Ow. Huh. Who am I? And I was drafted second overall in 2015. That should give it away, hockey fans. Or the injury. Which is kind of a unique one. There you go, mix up, Jack Eichel. Buffalo! There's the Buffalo logo right there. I like the little shield. God, it looks like a, what, a 50th anniversary logo on the back. It's a David Adams sticker, NHL sticker. Pretty nice. Oh, and there's the David Adams authentication card inside these pouches as well. I kind of wish I had like a plastic bag around it too, but I guess this nylon bag is safe enough. Just show really quick for the doubters. Jack Eichel. All right, that's Chris Maxwell with the Buffalo Sabres. All right, two more to go. Share your hits with Hit Parade if you'd like. Okay, I don't know this player. But hopefully you do. Um, oh, I am a... I am a retired hockey player, so let's go to... HockeyReference.com. Let's see which team he played. Well, although the, his team... That's, sorry, my bad. The, the team should be on his helmet. So we'll, we'll look at that in just a second. Okay. Um, who am I? Goaltender, 5'10", 178, 178 pounds. Uh, goaltender, caught lefty, played for three teams my entire career, and was drafted um, 54th overall in 1991. I'm 48 years old right now. Who am I? I was the last... NHL goalie to wear a traditional player's helmet cage combo instead of the newer one-piece goalie mask. Also one of the 12 goaltenders in history to have scored a goal and one of only seven to have scored by shooting the puck directly into the opponent's net and not an own goal. I'm ranked 12th in wins with 401. Spent the first part of my 17-year NHL career with the Red Wings, then the Islanders, then the Blues, before returning to Detroit in 2005. Won three Stanley Cup championships, all with the Red Wings, with two of them coming while he was a starting goaltender. Now, I'm assuming that would be Red Wings. Yep, Ray got it. It's Chris Osgood. There it is. Detroit Red Wings helmet. There's the Osgood autograph. Osgood's currently a Detroit Red Wings studio analyst and part-time color commentator for the Bally Sports uh, Detroit Network. This is this one's a smaller helmet, but that's that's pretty cool. That's awesome. 
This goes to Detroit, which will be Mitchell. Mitchell, thank you. There's the uh, David Adams card on the inside. There's Chris Osgood right there. Nothing else inside these things. with that. All right, last one. Got another five in the store, ladies and gentlemen. Who am I? A uh, 33-year-old left winger, according to Wikipedia. Shoots right. Uh, and selected uh, 26th overall in the 2007 NHL draft. And I'm making, I made my third stint with this team. So I was drafted by this team. Then went to another team, and then another team, another team, and then back to this team for a season, and then another team, and then back to this team for a few years. And recently played 56 games, 19 goals, 39 assists, for a total of 58 points. Let's see what this, this helmet must be the team that he's played for three different times. Yes. So he, yes, B-Man, you got it. I was going to, I was going to give some more clues, but you got it. 26 overall, picked by the Blues, played with the Blues for one, two, three, four, five, six seasons. Then the Oilers for a couple seasons, Penguins for a couple seasons, Ducks, then the Blues again, then the Golden Knights, then back to the Blues where he's been the last few seasons. That goes to Greg. There's his autograph right there. David Perron. Perron? There's the Fanatics authentication card right here. Nice. St. Louis Blues once again going to Greg. All right, and that's it. That was the fifth and final helmet. Thanks for watching. Thanks for playing. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.